nothing to say and we have nothing to do. It was it mean he's going afar. He's going to that junction. Hallelujah. We may think he's going to another country. To you is a country. But to some people is a junction and some people is a corner. Hallelujah. It will be a great pleasure and a moment to tell you the truth is sad to work in a government that you know that you've been in a government in a long time and every day the government is over. Every government, every country has a time limit in the reality to worship or to work in the vineyard. Hallelujah. And also in the time limit is ended, somebody takes over the government. And the battle has been taken to somebody. He said, This race that we are living is a race that when you run to the ending point, you give a brother, a sister, a battle to take over. And I know Pastor Louis has been best in this uh, church. I will not talk much, but I know will be coming here they will say a lot because pastor will be coming at the end of uh, the sermon or the voice or the words that they will be giving at the end of the day pastor will be the last person to speak and then we also have the gifts that the church have for him to say to him muito obrigado jokonjal baraka Mercy, bar, hallelujah. I think if somebody do something to you great, at the end of the day, he say thank you. Which means we need more from you, expected from you, but to our own heart, you are living. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Auntie Mai, are you set? Let's give a round of applause to Auntie Mai. Come in to give a speech on the women. Hallelujah. Let's give a round of applause. Good morning, church. Praise the Lord. I hope we are all happy to be here this morning. Um, I'm going to speak on behalf of the women in this church. We just want to say thank you to the great servant of God that God has given us source throughout these previous years. And now to be a servant of God is not something that is very easy. If it was a, a job to be employed, I know most of us would decide. Hallelujah. Because it goes through battle because of us. It goes through challenges because of us. Sometimes we even take our own insults and our own blames. So to be such is not an easy thing and no one fool you. And sometimes he have to face all kind of harassment because of us. And we know that he has been doing a great thing in our lives, standing for us both spiritually and physically. So that we just want to say thank you for being there for us, both what in the night, in the day, at all your lesser time. If you know that you are at home, you are never at rest. We will call you from different angles. This is what is going through. This is what is happening, and that you always stood for us. So we just want to say thank you for all your time, for all that you have been endeavoring for us, going through fasting, going through a lot of prayers with him, just to make so that our futures are bright. So we just want to say thank you. And also that we know where you are going to. You need our prayers more than any other thing. Because being a servant of God is not an easy thing, just as I said earlier. But we pray that where you are going to, God will surely lift you up in the name of Jesus. And the powers in the place will never hold you bound. And your destiny will never be cut short of. And your wishes will be fulfilled to the end until you hand over the button according to God's plan and purpose for your life. So we just want to say thank you for everything that you have been doing for us in this ministry. Thank you. Thank you, Auntie Mike. Please, those at the back, can we come and feed this place, please? please uh. 
those at the back, please, let's fill this place. Please, uh, if you have uh, anything uh, that you want to say, please, after, like, if they want to, man who is coming to give a word of speech, is it a good thing and it's so sad hallelujah praise the lord i think i will be the one to speak and i will call hallelujah i have a word here thanks church on behalf of the church I want to take this opportunity, hallelujah, to have the word. The word goes on. I want to take this opportunity to give thanks to God for giving me this opportunity to work with the great government of Pastor Lou, who is no more a person, but be Louis. We have been working together since a long time till now. We have been working with him for a long time now. But we have been, I have been surrounded with him, who is no other person but Pastor Louis. As a co worker, as a pastor, as a mentor, and as a father in the house of the Lord in the spiritual. It is so sad moment to say goodbye. To you, Pastor. But we can't stop because it is the work of God. The church has been developed by your leadership and by your government. We know how hard it is to be a leader in this circumstance. You are always there for us when we call when we need. What a man of God that we have in this branch of King William. You stood for the kids, you stood for the women, you stood for the choir, you stood for the horses, you stood for even those that are not members of this church. You are always there for the church as a pastor and as a man as a man who represents the kingdom of God, who is ambassador of God sent to Cape I have witnessed two governments that come through, which is your government become the second one. As a man of God, I was here first with Pastor Sam, and he has left so sad. But it is so sudden to stay with you as a moment and as a long time when people may think it's not a long time but to me it's a long time. And to say to you goodbye, it sets me tears to say goodbye. What a sad moment today to see a man that is worked together, that is staying close to him, that you've been with him quite a long time not even in a talk time. Sometimes I would be the one to give talk, talk times. Because sometimes I have busy charges, I have nowhere to be seen. But still, you stood by your ground to make sure that the charge is not taken by one person. What a moment to be called a man of God. You are not only a man of God, but you are a mentor. You are that man that stood on behalf of God on his heart. When you are coming as a government, as a pastor, into this ministry, we do not have the tiles of this church. We do not have ceilings of this church. The church was not showing love to each other. But I have God made that you put laws to each and everyone by your government that the church was organized. We will not forget your moment. 
We will not throw away the sayings that says, He that wants to lie, make him take an excuse from me. If I give you the green card, you can go. What a moment of a saying that life we can make it. What a moment by a word that you always say the university of tears is part of life. And what are the difficulties that you pass through in life as his words that says. He say you must pass the test of it. And Pastor, not as been we, we've been with you. I have been with you since the Kunda. And I transferred before you to Kekoje. And when you come to Kekoje, what a moment that I never thought of staying with you and being with you, being with your government, being with under you as a man of as a mentor, as a co-worker, and as a father to all. This church we are building today. It's not because of you are gone, you are gone, or you are dead. It's because of the love and kindness and the smile that you do give to each and every one of us. It's not because of you are the best pastor in India. But to us, you are the best to us. Because we stay with you and we know who you are by the little time that we stay with you. What a great moment and what a sad moment to say goodbye to her. As the song goes and says, When you say you are going, my heart stays in pain. When you said you are going, I remember the moment, the time, the hours, the days, the night that we spent together, the prayers that we organize in church, the parties that we throw together in church, the words and the sermons that you give in church, the words of prophecy that you give. The words that will allow people to come in this vineyard and their life will change. What a life that you give to people in the land of Kimberley. We will not forget you as a pastor and we will not forget you as a man of God. The prayer for the day is for you, pastor, not as Billui. We are praying that the world will hear the voice. We are praying for the moment that you stay with the people that have been crying day and night and you give them that joy, that comfort zone. We are praying that God will depend on that issue. That God will change your story. That even God will give you a smile of hope when time comes. God will give you a heart, a woman of your own, your own heart and a woman of your liking. We are praying as a church today that your woman, that your mother will not destroy your home. But he will be there to make you home. We are thanking you, Pastor Louis P. Louis. I can remember when we go to your friend to make a comedy. And I was in and I was the eyes of the God that day I can remember the smile the moment the joy the happiness that we have as a church you hold us as your brothers and we are so happy finally I know if I want to take this opportunity to speak on these things today, we will spend the night here. There is a word that you do tell me, even no matter how hard it is, Samba, we can make it. <coughs> Look at your neighbor and tell your neighbor, we can make it. I know it will be sad to say goodbye to Pastor Louis. What a sad moment today. Called me quite a long time. I said, "Your pastor is going. What do you really care for him?" I said, "I may have the meat to eat. I may kill a cow. I may give anything to make sure that we throw a party for him. But it does not make any sense for me to do that. 
Why did I say that? Staying with Pastor have been quite a moment. And it been a sad moment to say to him goodbye. To okay, Kimbuye. And all the men of God, I want to take this opportunity to say to you, thank you for standing with us and Pastor Louis. I know by him alone he can make it. I want to thank each and everyone. Sometimes you speak hard on Daniel, but Daniel will not give up. As a word of a father, sometimes it's very hard to say it. You give you that word that will pin you. But at the end of the day, you see it has a word that will make your life better. Sometimes a line pastor will take this opportunity as a church to say to you, we may do some things that is wrong to you. We may offend you unknowingly, unknowingly, or deliberately. I am standing on behalf of the church to say to you to pardon us in one way or the other that we have uh, offended you and we do bad things against you or we speak words that are not right on your behalf we are saying as a church or you have given us a role and we fail to close the gap and you take the beatings for us as Christ have taken the whip and the beating for us and stood by this ministry and said by your word Every house has a toilet. And if you don't take care of that toilet in your house, it will smile. And you are that man that has a toilet, has a ministry, but you always clean your toilet very clean. We thank you for being that sample. We thank you for being that over. We thank you for being that soap in this ministry that you always make us white as nose. We know it is hard to say goodbye. We know it is hard to say goodbye. But this moment, this time, on behalf of the church, we are saying a warm goodbye and a happy journey of life. That this journey that you've started, may no woman, no man, destroy your vision. May no man, no woman, Come your way to stop you. May these five billion souls uh, that you are praying for to recover in this world before you take off, may it come to accomplish in the name of Jesus. I personally know where you're going. It's going to be a tough time as a government to start. As you come here, you start with us with seven people. And today we are counting more than seven and more than people that you've mentored in this place. Everybody has a bot. But we are not looking at your bot. We are looking at the great things that you've done in this ministry. And I thank also the church, the mothers of this house, our fathers in this house. You keep us as your kids. You keep us as your leaders. We say to you, thank you. We say to you, thank you for embracing us. Thank you for staying with us. Thank you for being with us. For one moment that I want to give this word of encouragement to each and everyone who is staying here and who is on this occasion. Do not leave the church because pastor is going. Do not leave the church because social person is going. We are not worshiping Pastor Louis. We are worshiping the God of the universe. Hold tight with God and hold tight with the man of God who is coming. Know that one day your reward will be for God and not for man. Thank you so much. Omuitu Gurugaro, Jokanjad, Abaraka. Na simbati na barani u tuta tu. Ani. Uh, lastly, let's rise up to our feet for the honor. Hallelujah. Let's rise up to our feet. Hallelujah.
warm welcome to Pastor Lee, the last Sunday of him. Let's give him a round of applause. Hallelujah! Let's give him a round of applause in the time. And then I book your name. Uh, at the moment, I think we'll call on uh, the youth that is which is Reverend Peter. Let's give him a round of applause. Let's give him a round of applause. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, so much. Good morning, church. Uh, on behalf of the youth, uh, as a president of the youth of this church, a good day, friends. Here to give them uh, our pastor, Pastor Louis, for being with us. Uh, I can say since I joined, I am feeling the party to be with you. He always keeps encouraging me. Reverend, you can do this, do this, do this, and uh, I've been seeing the youth growing, and I've been seeing also what God has been doing to them. And, uh, been with him also in this branch. I've been seeing upliftment in prayer and also dedicated to the service of God. There are a lot of things that here, yeah, some of the youth, uh, before they came here, they were nothing that they could do in the house of God. But by the grace of God, through the, the ministry of God's servant, Pastor Louis, some of us and some of the youth here were able to hold the mic and preach. You understand? To be able to hold the mic and preach, and some of them will know that they don't even know their gift, their talents. By the grace of God, in His servant Pastor Louis, some of them we are able to do some things in the house of God today. Most recently, in Kebude, people are saying Kebude branch, Kebude branch, Kebude branch. It's through the God's servant using everybody. You always believe in people's what capability. He believe that everyone and every man being is born with something. That is a gift in you. That is something that you have for your generation. So therefore you always give opportunity to people and through God. I just want we just want to say thank you so much for your effort. You know, impacting the youth, most recently us and uh, some of the brethren also by praying for us also giving us opportunity stand in the whole bit of gospel and also minister in songs and whatever and also helping us to to know our talents and our gifting and to know our purpose of being in this world through him also some of us we are not useless some of the youth we have left a lot of things through him when we encounter him encounter God through him we have seen a lot of changes some of us, we are drunkards in the streets. Some of the youths, we are uh, womanizers. A lot of things that have been happened. But when God has used it for our lives, we have seen transformation. And today, to the glory of God, even as it's going to another place, we still believe that we are connected in the spirit. We are all together. Anytime you need us, we are there for you. Because we are nobody when God sent you to our lives. And today we can stand and hold in mind. Today we can do a lot of things in our life. Even some of us in our education background, some of the youth that are here, through you also, you have inspired them a lot. To an extent that they become serious with whatever they have and with whatever God has mandated that God has given to them. They become so very serious with it and they never do with their life. So on the behalf of the youth of KPJ branch, we just want to say thank you. Lord will continue to bless and lift up your hands. And the place you are going to, I pray that this cooperation will in of Jesus. Lord will use you as you impact the youth here. God also will use you to impact the youth there in the Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you so much, uh, Reverend Peter. For that word, we just thank you also for that word. We really it's the more time. I want us to call Peter. He had a word for us. And we give him five minutes, please. Five minutes maximum, please. Thank you. I started 
That means he's leaving us, but he leaves something in us, within ourselves. But the only thing we need to do now, let's allow him to do the work of God. He's, he's on his mission. As he's transferring, I believe God has released something out of us here. But the only thing now, because even Paul said, he said, now time will come for you now to exercise your faith. Not I service. Pastor is here before. Now pastor is taken away. Now we this is the moment now for us. Now we exercise our faith. You see? But he leaves something up for us. I saw you just doing this t-shirt for us. For me, I take my own and I wear a t-shirt, a green t-shirt. So I saw this me and he saw I saw him just, just like this. Just, this is the back. He's just taking them, throwing. But not everybody has it. You see, not everybody has it. He's just throwing it. You see? It's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a good sign. So I just want to encourage people. He's a man of God. We thank what he, we thank God for what he has been doing in this place. You see? But I want to encourage you also. Put your faith in God, in the word of God. Don't trust in man too much. But you see now, it's, it's now taken from us. You see? But the world will end. And I believe also, in, as, as, as someone said, he said, it's, it's, so, so for some people, it, it, may, it may be transferred, they will just see it as it is going to another place. But others will consider it as a person. So we are insisting in one, uh, in one mission, in, in one church. So I just, I just want to thank you. Thank you for the Let's give him a round of applause. Hallelujah. Uh, Reverend Peter said he had a testimony to give. We we'll give you two minutes, please. Two minutes to give us a testimony. Thank you. Let's give a round of applause. And, uh, uh, I just want to say this if I don't see uh, a lot of fear to God and uh, to man and God's servant too. Amen. I was one going through the battle of life, and as Peter said, the university of tears and frustration. Uh, before coming here, there are, I was somewhere else doing the work of God, but I am not satisfied according to, uh, in my own self. I'm not satisfied. I'm not doing it to my best. I'm not seeing myself. And with that, things were happening a lot in my life. I was thinking that, you know, I will never make it in life. I was thinking that, you know, I will, I will never one day stand in a big place or preach the gospel, you know, in the different places. I have lose hope. I was just like that, walking around, doing all lot of things, even as a man of God. Even fall sometimes and and walking in blindness, I mean. Until one time he was coming to Sifu, Pastor Lee, God's servant. He called me and said, Reverend Peter, I cannot come to your village as you are a pastor and I abandon you. He said, I am coming to your village, so please, I want you to come and attend this crusade. I said, oh, that's great. And before that, during the National Fest here, I don't know, the second year of your national program, he invited me to come. So that means he did not forget me. Amen. He invited me, but I'm under someone. But when he invited me for this crusade, I said, I must go. So I was late, but the moment I reached, how the man will come in alone. I went home that night, I was thinking of this. How can a man be preaching, people, and I was just entering, and they just stopped preaching, and then he welcomes me. Sat down, and then from there, I do the closing prayer. When I went home, I, on my way going home, I was not comfortable on the way. I was just praying and praying and saying, God can lose, use Pastor Lee, whom I know. No. A man that cannot talk. If God can use him to do all this, in one of me, then God can use me. So from there, God has done what he, he had to do. And today, I am with him. And he has been pushing me, Reverend, you can do this. Reverend, I want to see the best in you. You can do this. Do it. You can do this. He has been pushing me. Though I was lazy and I lose hope. Cry and then... God has just bring him to wipe my tears. And today, whatever I am today, God has used him to do it in my life today. Amen. God bless you. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. What a testimony that I... Let's give 
just worship him. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. I think you people should be 
be happy and be on fire. That yes, I am what I am today. This guy empowered me. So that when you are here, the way you will dance, the camera with crusades. Which you will come and crusades, huh? Empowered. So this is what I want to tell you people. I've worked with so many of you here. I've seen characters. I've seen behaviors. But I'm not a leader that you know that. I preach people on the pulpits. Whatever you do, if I want to handle you, I always say. There was a time when I wanted to handle like, uh, Daniel or someone. I don't know. What, what did I tell you people? When that I cannot you? mix handling people with preaching. I do it for three of my time. And then remove what was in my heart. And then you know what I did? About I don't know, Daniel or someone. I told him Daniel you should not do that. That's not right. But then I started preaching real gospel. So that tomorrow you will not say, oh, he's preaching was was. Empowering on me. That's what I'm So I want you people to know. I'm happy by the grace of God when I was young. People are on fire. Gideon Pastor Louis, I see a young boy coming up. Oh, he's coming up. People are on fire. And that can't be changed. Yes. He's Gideon Pastor Louis. Who is Pastor Louis? I'm Pastor Louis. I'm People, this video, this video, it's on YouTube. When he will be 30, when he watches himself on YouTube, he will see himself how he was. He will know that truly God has lifted him from somewhere to where he is. So everybody should understand and know. Understand and know that I'm leaving a that does not mean that I'm leaving permanently. I don't think even people I, I think it should be a moment of empowerment. It should be a moment that you are on fire for him. I'm, I'm, I'm careful what to say and what not to say. I'm careful. But I want all of us to know I am not telling anybody to follow me to La Cria Branch. I'm covered. I'm not telling anyone to do what? And that you are not getting. Ah? If you want to come, it's your own. Don't put your mouth up, Pastor Louis said, Pastor Louis, I am not telling anyone. Nobody can stop you to come, but I'm not telling anyone. So you must understand that very clearly. Yes, I'm not telling anyone. I love working with all of you. Yes, I'm not telling anyone. Look at me, because I'm living. How many of you church have been called? Because Louis is living. Oh, Louis is living. Louis is living. Well, it's, it's not a good sign. Well, it's not a good sign. 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 It's not a good because the way I am wearing is not the way others are wearing. And by the grace of God, I mean, you have how many years now? I think two years. Two years, three. Two years of three. By the grace of God, I have served with my whole heart. I have served with my whole heart. And when it comes to any way, whether relationship, I have never abrogated my relationship with anybody here. Whether they take a bottle or cut in any way, but nothing I want to do. You might think otherwise, but never. And I, I am not. This is where I told you. I don't like being around. I love from afar. So you must understand that I am. When I was here, I've never insulted elderly people. Number two. Number two. Never insulted what? Elderly people. Number three. When I was here, all the children, the youth. So that I raise everybody to the high epics. But if I want to deny, maybe if I want to keep helping you, you keep saying, no, I cannot do it. And I keep following you. But I try to make sure I raise up there. And that is how I've been leading. So, you might see me today as I'm your best. You might see me today as I'm your best. 
My time has ended. Let me tell you. If your time has ended in a place and you are still there, problems will come up. So my time has ended. Maybe the one coming even you will fall in love with the person more than you. You just need to be flexible. You understand that? Just need to be flexible. That does not mean that. For example, who knows? Maybe this guy. In the next one month or two months, he's going to be given a prize somewhere. Somebody can can now assist somebody. They can mix. Probably, I'm just giving us some. I don't know. They can mix so many people. So, so in that mixing, we you say somebody is not in church, I'm not going to church. Pastor is not in church. I don't know. I'm not going to church. It's going to be very funny. It's going to be very funny. So I want all of you to keep pounding for him. I'm going to play to look at the people around me. We can be meeting in national events. I will move to that angle and begin to hit the same way I am hitting when I was young. The whole week. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. 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 Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday.
place. But when you are in the place, he will jack you. He goes. You yourself, you will know that truly, I don't want to leave this place. But the project will still continue under the leadership of people that are here. But I don't know. But people also want to live it like that until they find travel out and I send you money to develop a product. I'm never forget, I'm telling you, never forget you people, you people are big and true. Sapa, I've been working with this man. Sapa, I've never had problem. Any problem anymore. Any day Sapa is busy, I will cover him up. I will cover him. And nobody will know that Sapa is not in church. Give me the anyway. I will cover him up. Is somebody in church? Yes, he gave. What is like? I saw somebody in church table. I don't know who he is. I don't know somebody. Somebody in church. Somebody in church. Somebody in church. The way I used to operate to a level. If you always feed people, give people report of what is happening here. Now I remember those. Now you are the pastor. Let him come and make you the pastor. Because you have the right to give you information. I'm here. 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 People now to be, be, be like that. You think anything that happens if the hour of that, two minutes, three minutes, anything that happens, you are paraphrasing like that. Now I will call a pastor and tell a pastor, let's give you the pastor. I will look at you from And me, let me be a member. That is how I managed to stop too many gossip, gossip here. Okay, not that youth to come to the youth. Everybody will be reporting. We have brought this house to a level. Even though if they own Sambia, but anybody, it can be a puzzle or anybody. Can tell Sambia what is happening in Kebuto. Sambia will say, "What well, has pastor? Is it pastor? Even though you know, Sambia, what has pastor? You people, what is wrong with you? Are you yourself to me speaking for each other? This is where I go. 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 This is where I you can do that. For me, that I have done my best. I do my best. I serve you people well. I make sure that everybody loves Jesus. I make sure that Kebuye is seen as the most prayerful branch ever. Kebuye is not to be making prayerful branch. He said prayerful the most. That small children can handle you. But Kebuye, you pray you to death. I'm happy I've seen you are warded. What I mean by warded, if somebody is defending the case, they make sure they defend it to the, to the last touch. For example, you're talking about revival, you make sure you defend revival. Give your defense of a revival to the last So, I am here. What you do? You have my phone number, you have my everything. Call me, reach out to me. Green. I'll be busy, I'm telling you. Okay, These days I don't know what's your problem. Don't don't you know, even, even last night, someone tried calling me several times. Right? Calling me, we, we could not even get each other. I was calling, I was in a meeting, I cannot call that meeting. So he wrote to me, I just replied. So if you call me, you say I don't pick right. Send it. Do it now, wait down, man. People are going to be cool. Send it. Or you are using WhatsApp, send me a voice. But you tell WhatsApp, command a room. Hallelujah. And I pray to see you people in most of the nine videos. And and then and then in most of the joints are to Wednesday coming, it will be my last Wednesday here. I pray to see you people all. And as years goes by, I pray to be calling from South Sudan. <laughs> Hallelujah. I pray to be calling from different places. And Hallelujah. Amen. And by the grace of God, if my mom comes, the last year I see for the journey, you meet to go Create a day and I'll bring her. That's what I'm going to do. You will to see her here. You understand? And even though I'm not bringing her here, but you will really make sure that I make sure that I. Thank you people to come and before she goes off, you must go for dinner. We must go and eat. Eat American dollars. American dollars. Hallelujah. Amen. This all of you, your prayers are some. So I just want to maybe somebody wants to 
say something five minutes. I'm just left with five minutes. See my time. I'm a white man, I respect that. I'm left with five minutes to come back. So any more people who want to say maybe one word about how I have been here, if I have literally offended some certain people by the way, don't come back to me. All of you forgive me. It was because of ministry. Forgive me. I'm happy to see my on fire for Jesus. My God. Jesus, 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 my God. Some small on fire. So all of you should be on fire. The problem that you have, the ones that are around say now. They started saying that the is now. So you have been coming for two years. Now that's why you say the is now. You are from now. is now. It's very funny you. So we we'll see what God will do. And I tell you, any help you need, call me. I'll be attending to all of you. All of you. You want to start preaching? Morning for me. Come and join 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 me. He lost people like me sometimes. I see him. Forgive people around to play with you. So he lost people like me. Some of you will not feel any difference in it. So anybody that has something to say? One minute, one minute.
Thank you. This is uh, the token that we have in. Thank you so much. 